Morning, folks. Say morning. Uh, yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Buenos dias, folks. Yeah, it's like that this morning. We had to run out of that house so fast. God bless you. Shan cha shan. Ciao. He cannot have any more tardies. I refuse to let him be tardy anymore. So. Yeah. Me and Hubby had like the in-depth conversation last night. Um, about life. Donovan, sit back and sit. What did I just tell you? Sit back. No, I didn't lock the windows. Who unlocked the windows? Anyway, morning, everyone. Got us to the school on time. Yay. I'm so sleepy. But what we're going to do is we're going to get home, get moving. It's laundry week, so we're going to get as much laundry as we can get done today as well as um, get to the gym and get dinner cooked. And those are like the basic goals for the day. And if we can at least do those, we're good, right? Um, I'd like to touch base with that pantry again today. <laughs> Excuse me. I pantry again today and get videos edited. I've got to get some videos edited for you guys. Mm. And get to Shia to do my hair. Um... So that means I've got to get it. What? I've got, I've got to get it um, washed and stuff before I go to the gym. So I believe that's what I'm going to do right now is get the little boys settled and then try to get in the shower and wash my hair before I get to the gym. What y'all think? Throw this in there for y'all. <laughs> I'm downstairs. I told you. Still a little bit of chaos mess going on right now, but I'm okay. I'm okay. <laughs> um, threw together some um, Hawaiian rolls, spaghetti sauce, and meatballs for the little boys for lunch because we are going to the gym. So I did need to make to-go lunches um, so I don't have crabby kids and so I could stay a bit on schedule. Sorry if the camera angle is terrible. I haven't got my new case to where I can hold the phone the way I need to, how I need to. Um, to record so this is just as good as it gets unless I use the selfie camera and I decided not to focus moving back um so I just finished my egg whites um egg whites and oatmeal I just made my egg whites and oatmeal I just ate that mm. finished that did a little bit of spinach on this morning because I do have like a lot of fresh spinach in it that I need to get rid of and I've been doing more salad than just spinach so this week I'll do more spinach than just salad but this is just how it goes. Like, you have to keep it moving. You have to keep it moving, guys. It's okay. I'm going to incorporate some vinegar and baking soda into my towel wash because they are getting pretty rough. Um, or in, my, 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 in my opinion, they're getting pretty rough. So I'm going to incorporate that into the towel wash. But, yeah, I just want to give you guys an update on, like, just how, you know, crazy and busy it gets. And that we're going to get through this. We're going to work through this guys. Of getting everybody sleep at the same time. Something like that at least. This one doesn't really sleep unless someone's holding him anymore. Ooh. Even a dog. Sleep. Okay, everyone is asleep. I'm going to switch the laundry and then I'm going to shower and then I'm going to pray that everybody's still asleep <laughs> and uh, fold some more clothes and no I'll wait till they wake up to fold clothes I can do that when they're folding when they're awake hmm. this is always one of my struggles until I get the routine down pack like what can I accomplish when um while they're asleep like oh there's so many things on the list but what do we really do? No. Tonight's dinner got rescheduled from steak and eggs to leftovers because there's like crazy spaghetti in there. Um, what else is in there? I saw a big container of something else in there. So I'm just like, nope, leftovers it is. So we're good with dinner. Mm. Meal preps. And I do got to uh, finish organizing the pantry. So...
Ready, go. Look who's up. I managed to make it out of the shower and stuff, but yeah, Mr. Here didn't sleep very long. <laughs> These two are knocked out. I think they only have about 30 or so minutes left of their nap. Not even, probably not even 30 minutes, but we'll get them up here in a minute. I'm trying to get some clothes folded and then we'll probably all transition downstairs because there's things I need to do downstairs. I got my braids back. My boo hooked me up when we got to the gym earlier. Um, yeah, she wanted to wash my hair this morning and had, she braids. She just did the two quick braids at the gym and then we worked, I tied it up and then we worked out. Um, yeah, y'all see this black stuff in my ear? There's a bump, I cannot stand bumps in the ear. Oh, I cannot stand bumps in the ears. And like for, it's not even like blackheads or anything gross. I just, you know how you get a really bad bump and it's sore? And then, um, you know, it's sore for a long time and then it's like, you have to, you can squeeze it and it comes to a head. I think this is going on in my ear. It's been there for quite some time. It's actually, starting to hurt when I put my earbuds in so I was like just squeezing in my ear and I put this in here hoping um this is that charcoal glue peel mask I've done it on my inside of my son's ears because he does get the small black heads in his ears I've done it in his ears before and it worked really really great just for pulling out you know those little extra whatever those little the pores pulling out whatever's in those pores in your ear very safe because nothing's going in the ear hole and it's just the charcoal and um i'm sorry about the camera angle my arm's kind of tight um <laughs> so that's what i'm doing in both my ears that's this black stuff right here so yeah uh, I managed to just throw that together and then, because it's just a charcoal, like a cap charcoal. If, anyway, if you want details on that, let me know and I'll do a little quick video on that. But, um, yeah, just letting it dry and then at some point, you know, amongst all the crazy things that, I've, that I do and I'm doing at home, I'll just pull it out. Um, and then pull it out slowly and hopefully um, that big bump that I'm having issues with uh, like either like comes to a head or something and I can like squeeze the rest out or something. I don't know because the bump is really bothering me and I would let my husband pick at it, but it might hurt. So I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> you don't want whipped cream? Look. I can't. Daddy got to turn it up. Make sure you turn it up, up, Daddy. Okay. Yes, you can. Okay. Say ah. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. See, Daddy going to give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> So everybody is home and I'm getting dinner together here. Our leftovers, leftover spaghetti, leftover chicken, different stuff like that. Getting all that together. Mommy's running out of energy. I talked to a, a, a bodybuilder at um, the gym today and she was just mentioning how um, cutting carbs is good for losing weight, but eventually it will catch up to you and you won't have any energy and then to get your for your body to get energy it'll start eating on your muscle and i've been great like i feel great i even dozed off and got a nap but it, no <laughs> sooner did you know she say that my energy has been like it's like i can feel it dwindling down like i need to nurse but my chest is not as full as it normally would be and um and like my energy is like down so um, mommy's actually incorporating carbs into the dinner tonight i'm gonna do a little bit of hawaiian bread with some shredded chicken and a salad um so and then i'll add some brown rice in here and there um, i was gonna substitute the rice brown rice for the cauliflower um, but i'm glad i didn't do that yet um because i guess the only carbs i will do is the brown rice and the granola which is uh oatmeal why would you put rice in the salad that was that, that's not good Boy, put them toys back up in there. Are you See, now you got to wash your hands again because you're touching on toy, dirty toys instead of coming over here and doing the salad like you wanted to. I come on, come on, come on, come on, chill the red. Come do the salad, dude. What, what did I put? Oh, the Every dressing? Yes, just squeeze it all everywhere and squeeze it from the bottom. Woo. Woo. Squeeze it all everywhere. Don't forget the front. Yeah, front. Mm -hmm. Hold it down. Make sure you get it all out the back. Okay, let me see. I don't want to do. Good job, but baby, you squeeze. You gotta squeeze from back here, and you keep squeezing it back here. It's all right to have help, SJ. You hear me? Okay. We gotta do good right there. Okay. Good job. Um, I'm gonna pull these things out of my ear, and I just wanted to ah, get my reaction. Ah, oh, God. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, it hurt just a little bit. Oh, it hurt just a little bit. I don't know what it looked like in there. Can y'all see? Like in my ear? What it looked like in my ear? Ouch. All right, guys, so I'm gonna pull out the other side. That black face mask thing, ah! <laughs> it didn't hurt terribly, but it it's a little uncomfortable. I did. Oh, so. this is so interesting. Like, if you look in deep and detail, it does pull up like, yeah. It just pulls like everything out of your pores. Let's see. Yeah. It's kind of gross, kind of weird. I know. Oh, well. Sorry. Keep it real. More life than you know. Be good to each other and yourself. Ciao.